Hello everyone, this is Steve with Off Grid 48. Welcome back to the Wood Gasifiers Builders Workshop. Today I wanted to share with you our newest acquisition to our shop. We've got a, here a uh, powered slip roll, 50 inch powered slip roll, and I kind of want to walk through that and uh, show you its features. But basically, uh, we recently decided that we need an upgrade from our previous slip roll, in which we see here on the side. This is a Grizzly 50 inch uh, slip roll. Ben actually recommends this slip roll in his book. Uh, this is a 50 inch 18 gauge slip roll, uh, but it's manual. It's got a manual crank on it. Uh, I mean, even though it's rated at only 18 gauge, we've successfully been using it for the last five years for up to 11 gauge uh, material. But what we found out recently with the addition of our newest uh, version 3 housings that the pieces were getting so big that I think we basically pushed the limits on this manual slip roll so uh, it's very uh, labor intensive to full set and then with these latest parts I think we've kind of pushed the limits of what we can do with this little slip roll this is a grizzly slip roll uh, it's an excellent slip roll I mean it works very well but uh, it also you can break your back just uh, rolling parts for a complete build so it became apparent when we were doing these version 3 housings that we needed to upgrade our slip roll and decided if we're going to do that I'm going to go to a powered slip roll so we decided to uh, invest in this uh, GMC this is a uh, 14 gauge 50 inch powered slip roll it's got a uh, one and a half uh, horsepower motor this is a three phase slip roll so we only have single phase power here in the shop so we invested in this uh, phase-o-matic converter so it converts our single phase into three phase uh, so we're good to go and then um, you see here that it's got the controls it's got a foot pedal control lots of safety features uh, emergency cutoff switches um, but this is going to really save my my uh, arms and my back from rolling this this is going to do uh, anything that we throw at it and I'm going to be able to keep up. We, we do so much rolling now between the kits and the builds that um, it's very labor intensive. So really looking forward to uh, using this powered slip roll to get ahead uh, of all the parts uh, that we need. Um, I think it's going to be a great addition to the shop. i got to figure out how to make some more room for it. Here's some roll material that we've done with uh, some test rolls here just set it up yesterday you can see here we've got some pending material that I've got to roll and then over here on the rack and the wall I've got a whole bunch of other material that I got to get rolled for these kits but uh, just wanted to share that with you the uh, having this powered slip roll is going to be a big benefit for us and uh, you know if you found out if you're starting your builds you can't do one of these builds without having real parts uh, I'm not doing this video to suggest that you go out and buy a uh, roller. The cost of the roller is going to exceed the cost of your bill, uh, whole gasifier. But uh, uh, basically, you are going to need rolled parts. So whether you roll them yourself or you have somebody rolling for you, you are going to need rolled parts. They're a crucial part of your build. Uh, for us, uh, it's a crucial part of everything that we do. So I just wanted to share this with you guys and let you know. Um, hopefully this is going to help improve our build process and let things get done a little bit quicker. Uh, so that's about it. So uh, good luck on your builds and uh, keep uh, going out there promoting wood gas. See you on the next one.